Hey, Dave Spalding from Handgun Combatives. It's been quite a while since we've come at you with a skill drill, and quite frankly, I thought we were done. As I moved towards retirement, I really didn't think I had anything else to say, but it turns out that my friend and mentor, Ken Hackathorn, thought we could maybe be do one of our drills a little bit better, a little bit more, you know, ammo austerity here in 2021. The drill we're talking about is our 15 to the third drill. In that drill, you draw from the holster, put five rounds onto a three by five card, move laterally 15 feet, five more rounds on a three by five card, back to where you came from, five more rounds, and we try to get you to do that in 12 seconds or less. Again, all hits on a three by five. Why a three by five? Because in a linear fashion, that's about the size of the heart and the aorta. And that's about as good a shot as you can get with a pistol. But, you know, Ken makes a good point. With ammo being a dollar to a dollar and a half a round, taking some of that ammo off of that drill will still make the drill valid, will still help you build the skills, but can save you some money. So his suggestion to us was, why don't we do three rounds at a time? So you would draw, sh draw shoot three move laterally, shoot three, move back, shoot three. The more I got to thinking about that, I thought, you, you know, that makes sense. We can save people, you know, six bucks, six bucks plus, and they can still get the skills that we're trying to anchor. So we decided to call it the nine in nine drill. And let me explain to you why we do that. We've got a breakdown here for you to kind of give you an idea what you should be doing. Draw, shoot, get your first shot in two seconds or less. Half second split, half second split, three seconds to your first three rounds, and then three seconds to move laterally. Another half second, another half second, now you're at seven seconds. Move back to where you came from, three seconds. Half second, half second, 11 seconds. Okay, now that sounds like, hey Dave, you're only cutting a second off and you're eliminating six rounds. Well, that was under the assumption that you were shooting 33 splits because that's what we figured in 15 to the third. If you look at 33 splits for the same breakdown, oops, we're looking at nine seconds. So we thought, you know what? That's what we want people to strive for. We want you to get it all in nine seconds. That's where you're working. So we decided to call it the nine in nine. One of the suggestions Ken made to us was that, you know, instead of just pass fail, that's kind of how I am. It's like a gunfight. Either you win or you lose. My, my drills are the same way. Either you do them or you don't. And he said, but you got to give people something to strive for. I get that. No problem. So we get a breakdown here. We kind of feel like if you're carrying a gun for your personal security, you should be doing this consistently in around 12 seconds, maybe 1225, something like that. 11 seconds, you know, consistently, if you're doing it around 11 seconds, that's very good. If you're down around 10 seconds consistently, that's exceptional. And if you can meet our standard of nine seconds, again, consistently time and again, go practice something else. You don't need this, you're good. Go practice something you're not good at. So it's the nine and nine, and again, breaking it down to you, you're gonna be on a firing position, 15 feet back from the target, 15 foot spread. So you're gonna draw, you're gonna put three rounds on a three by five card, immediately move lateral, plant, shoot, three more, instantly move back to the other direction, three more. We want you to get it nine seconds with all hits. Tall order, I realize. But you know what? 11 seconds would be pretty darn good and 10 seconds would be exceptional. So enough talking, let me give it a run and see what we can do. down as you can see i dropped one just off to the side of the card you know what i could shoot this again and give you a clean run we don't do that you got to see what i did my time is 9 31 so you know what 
if I would have gotten that in in 931 at age 66, I would have been pretty happy with that. But that's what it breaks down, the nine and nine drill. But think about all of the combative skills you're doing. You're drawing from the holster. You're placing the gun on target where you need it. You're working the trigger. You're controlling the recoil. And then you're instantly moving as if something in your fight has changed. Again, three more rounds, recoil control, trigger control, back the other direction. So there's a whole lot of skills going on right here in nine rounds. So the nine and nine drill, give it a try. I think it's gonna help you be a better combatant. Dave Spalding, Handgun Combatives, thanks for checking in.